Hey guys, welcome back to Sass and Salt. I'm excited that you're here today. We are going to be making chocolate chunk cookies today. So let's get started on it. These are so good. We're gonna get started with blending our sugars here. So I have brown sugar. I have granulated white sugar. I'm gonna put in my salt. And then I have some melted butter here. We're gonna put this in here. And we're gonna give this a mix. Essentially, we're creaming these together. That looks good and combined. From here, we are going to put our vanilla and one egg. And we're gonna combine that. Turn this around so I can use the handle. You just want to make sure that you get that egg incorporated. That looks good. Our next step is going to require a sifter, a little mesh thing here. And I'm just going to have it up on the bowl here. We don't want to dip and dunk it in because we're going to be sifting our flour. So in here, we are going to do our all-purpose flour. And then we have our baking soda. And then we're just going to sift it in. And this kind of aerates your flour. It also incorporates the baking soda into the flour. And it also makes it, sometimes you get little hard pieces in your flour. Um, so, you know, it kind of sifts that out for any unwanted um, foreign objects that might be in your flour. Now here, we're just gonna fold. We've done folding before many times. So we're just gonna go here and towards the middle. Fold, scrape, and fold. Scrape, and fold. That is the consistency that we're looking for. All right, at this point, we are going to add our chocolate chips. I am doing uh, using these semi-sweet morsels and this is four ounces. It's a little bit less than a whole bag. So uh, this is four ounces of the chocolate morsels, semi-sweet. You can use uh, milk chocolate, dark chocolate, whatever it is you want. I have my chocolate morsels in here and normally I use this baker's um, a baking bar and I just chop it up with a knife. But at my local Dollar Tree, uh, I discovered these semi-sweet chunks. And look how cute these things are. OMG, they're so cute. Look, they're little, they're little squares, just little chunks all ready for you. So this is a four ounce bag. And then you're just gonna incorporate those into the dough. You might be thinking, that's a shit ton of chocolate for those cookies, for that dough. It is not. There is no such thing as too much chocolate in chocolate chunk cookies. These are going to spread out when you cook them, so you want to give them some space. You know, social distance your cookies. Okay, our cookies are finally cool enough where I can actually taste them without burning the inside of my mouth. So, I got one and a half here. Oh, good. It's chewy and chocolatey. And the best chocolate chunk cookie you will ever make and eat. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy. Follow me on Facebook. Please like, share, and comment. We love you guys. Huh? Shameless pig. Hey, I said it. Did you notice that I said it? I know.
so you can He's right there. This, this thing is fucking huge. He's on the light. Get out of here. Got him. Got him.